topic. Hope you all will like it. So, without any further delay, let's get started. In my last video of HTML series, I have discussed about lists in HTML. Today, I am going to discuss about tables in HTML. So, without any further delay, let's get started. HTML tables. HTML tables allows web developers to arrange data into rows and columns. A table in HTML consists of table cells inside rows and columns. Table cells. Each table cell is defined by a opening TD and closing TD tag. TD stands for table data. Everything between opening and closing TD tag is the content of a table cell. Table rows. Each table row starts with an opening TR tag and ends with a closing TR tag. TR stands for table rows. Table headers. Sometimes you want your cells to be table header cells. In those cases, use the th tag instead of the td tag. th stands for table headers. Here is an example of table in HTML. Within opening and closing table tag, tr tags and within tr tags, th tags which represents the table header followed by another tr tags for the rows and td tags for the data of the table. Let's apply this practically. Open text editor, save a file with html extension. Keep the text editor and browser side by side to check the progress. Starting with the basic tags in HTML. Within body tag, h1 tag for the heading followed by opening and closing table tag. Within table tag, opening and closing tr tag which represents row of a table. Within opening and closing tr tag, opening and closing th tag for table heading. Similarly, to fill up the data within the table using tr tag within tr tag td tags which again fills data within the table.
to give a border to the table styling it with the help of style tag within style tag table comma th comma td within curly braces border semicolon one pixel solid black you can see border is created but it's double stranded so to make the border single line using another css property border collapse that is border hyphen collapse semicolon collapse now you can see border is single lined we will be discussing more about how to style borders in different ways in my upcoming videos so stay tuned that's all for today hope you all will get some help from this video if it's so then don't forget to subscribe my channel code with neha and press the bell icon for regular updates see you in the next video till then stay safe stay happy